After watching this, be sure to subscribe and like it. And here comes the fifth place, the volcano Mount Fuji. Mount Fuji or, as it is also called, Fujiyama, is one of the most important Japanese landmarks. Climbing to its peak is a dream not only for many tourists, but also for locals. The fact is that in Japan, Mount Fuji is considered sacred, and everyone in the country just have to at least once in life to stand on top of it. By the way, women were allowed to climb the mountain in 1800, before that time only men had such a right. The volcano has almost perfect conical outlines, and is considered sacred, serving as a tourist attraction, as well as a religious pilgrimage site for Buddhist and Shinto cults. Fuji has been a popular theme in Japanese art for centuries. Most travelers tend to go to the site in July and August in these months, Mount Fuji is free of snow. Mount Fuji is an active volcano located on Honshu Island in the Fuji Hakoniaiza National Park. To date, the volcano is almost inactive. The last eruption was recorded in 1707 to 1708. It is worth noting that it was one of the strongest eruptions in the entire existence of Mount Fuji. At that time in Edo, the old name of Tokyo, an ash layer of 15 centimeters was formed. Many of you have probably seen the image of Mount Fuji in Japanese art. Almost all engravings depict the volcano with sharp, impregnable peaks and in snow. But in fact it's not that hard to conquer the mountain, and it doesn't always snow. Most travelers rush to this attraction in July and August these are the months when Mount Fuji is free of snow. In this peak tourist season there are all the amenities for visitors and local pilgrims, there are stores, small cafes, rescue centers and places to rest. Interestingly, the Japanese have provided absolutely everything there are even toilets. And this is the only place in Japan, where you have to pay to enter the common areas. By the way, many of the toilets run on solar panels, and even have a heated seat. Keep in mind that it takes 3 to 8 hours to climb the mountain, and 2 to 5 hours to descend, depending on your fitness. The entire route is divided into stations. Typically, tourists get to the fifth station by cab or bus, and then stomp on foot. At the very top of Fuji there is a Shinto temple, a post office, and a weather station. There are many hot springs on the volcano, and near its foot. Remember that it is strictly forbidden to litter on Mount Fuji. According to local rules, if you buy water at the store during the ascent, you can throw away only one empty bottle. All travelers are given special garbage bags. Every year about 200,000 people climb Mount Fuji. There are only four official trails that can be used to climb to the top of the volcano. The other trails are quite dangerous and difficult, which is why you should not trust unscrupulous guides. Unsupported trails are used exclusively for bulldozers, who deliver food and various goods for the stores. Just a reminder, please like and subscribe.